Hi friends, it's Nirmal from Nandanam Exotics and today we'll be getting to know the lady who rules the garden over here. Uh, isn't she pretty? So, hope you like the video. So friends, be sure to subscribe to my channel if you haven't done it already. Uh, be sure to also click the bell notification button near the subscribe button so that you'll be notified whenever I upload a new video. So my close friend got me this head, head uh, mannequin head that someone throwed away and I was left with just the head without a body to fix it to. So I had to improvise. So I thought of this uh, method to just raise it on top of a pole so that I can grow hanging plants really long and down the head. Uh, that is the reason why I did it so high and long. From now that I have growing space so that the hanging plants can really droop down for a certain while and then only I have to cut it down. Mm, the portion that I am showing you right now, I took a haul out of it. It was actually where the wig was attached to the head. I didn't get the wig obviously but there was a provision for that. I cut it out and made it a planter. So I have seen a lot of videos going around using turtle wine in different ways. So obviously it's a very versatile plant to use in the garden. So I just thought of introducing a new way of using that wine. So the chin portion was the most lowest point in the hollow part inside the head. So water drains and collects over there. This is the reason why I put a, drilled a hole there. You can see some of the paint that I have applied has totally eroded off because of the continued moisture there. Mm. This head planter was not meant for just turtle vine. You can actually grow anything that hangs and droops down. It really gives the effect of hair. I am so obsessed with head planters. They really animate the plant and it really feels like the really that pot has hair of plants. Uh, I love that dramatic feel that it gives to the garden. So this clips show you just after I painted the head uh, and now you can see a progression of how the plant started growing off the head. That's a turtle vine by the way, Tridescansia species I forgot. So the stand comprises of a base made out of cement and then the pawl is out of PVC which I have also uh, filled with cement for extra stability. And at the end, or the top of the pole, I used M seal to connect it to direct, connect it directly to the head of head portion. Uh, some of my friends and people who visit my garden ask whether the water drains down the pipe. Actually, no, it just falls or droops, uh, drips down from the chin of the head. Uh, this is how I have made the stand. Uh, it's pretty durable right now, but uh, I would not put too much pressure on it. Anyways. Um, the best part about the stand is that you can keep on rotating plants. You know that uh, drooping or trailing plants are very active growing plants. They do grow and re reach or bec become really big and unmanageable in just a season. So such stands can easily be used for rotating different types of plants that uh, could mimic the feel of a hair. I would always suggest small leafed uh, plants for such purpose that gives much more effect or give you the impression of hair uh, than big leafed plants but depends upon your head planter if the pl planter and the plant has come some kind of chemistry then it works.
so thanks for watching guys i hope you guys like the video uh, be sure to subscribe to the channel and expect more videos like this in near future i'll be updating uh, new videos every week